in Hua Hin, um, Bangkok. And I'm on a car. We are still on our way to Hua Hin. And we'll show you guys around Hua Hin for the next few days. And maybe Bangkok when I go back. So, yeah. Hi everyone, we are in Hua Hin. We just got out of our hotel and we changed. So this is my outfit. Yeah, it's very beachy, bikini style because we are going to the beach later. Time check right now, it's about 1.30, going to 1.30 and we haven't eaten anything. So we are going to find a restaurant to eat and then we'll just probably choose somewhere a cafe before watching sunset for today but gotta give it to the weather the weather today is bright and sunny and very hot so yeah hopefully you get to see sunset <laughs> so yeah we'll see you guys in the restaurant Hi everybody, so right now we are in the restaurant, it's by the beach. Actually, I don't know what this restaurant is called, but I will show you guys the link. But it's so pretty here, yeah, like, it's like a resort. And it's really not, a, I have no regret coming here. And we're waiting for our lunch, our meal we just ordered. And I'll show you guys what we eat later.
next day. Okay, currently it's actually 7.30 a.m. And I woke up very early because yesterday both of us slept very early, like night. We are asleep already because we are really very tired. And right now I'm just going to a nearby 7-Eleven to get some water and some like sore throat sweet because I feel like I'm gonna get a sore throat soon. So yeah. Everybody, right now we're actually at Praia Nakhon Cave and okay there's two way we took a tour and not really a tour but it's more of like a private car to bring us around and but you have to pay your own ticket to go up this cave it's like 200 baht per person and you can either walk up or take a boat the boat will cost 400 round trip but then um, it's gonna be very fast lah, like 10 minutes to and fro which I felt like it's not very worth because they give you 2 hours here and you spend so like fast to go to the cave so we shall update you later if it's worth it to climb or take the cave but right now I see like everybody taking just walking so should be good <laughs> Done. This is the after. Just now we didn't even tell her, but yes. Okay, it's actually a very very nice hike. It's not very hard, but if you are, you if you come with like children and elderly, maybe not the best because there's quite a bit of climb, but it's still manageable. Not the difficult climb. Yeah. So how was your overall experience? <laughs> yes. Now we are eating at a restaurant um, right at the entrance of the, the cave, the trail. Yeah, and we just ordered some smoothie. Look at how big the size. <gasps> Bigger than my face. Very good. Press it. Very good.
at I honestly don't know what it's oh is at Khao Siam Roy Yacht. Yeah it's supposed to all this is supposed to be like lotus. It's like lily pads but the lotus it's not a season so they are dead <laughs> or dried up. And by right we are supposed to have like a boat tour but because there's no lotus to look at we're just going to chill around here and probably go to somewhere else because it's still very early. It's around, it's only 12 and we literally finished hiking in 2 hours although they told us it's going to be a 3 hours hike. So yeah, very windy. I hope y'all can hear me. <laughs> Good morning! It's another day and right now we are waiting for our motorcycle. We are going to our breakfast place. Very excited! I think it's coming. I can hear it from far. Yes, and yeah, I'll bring you guys along. biking and now we are back um in our hotel again and we are resting so we are also like bought some grab food because we are very hungry and we are just very tired to go out anyway so we will make do with what we have yeah and later so actually fun funny story is that just now when we were in the breakfast place which we met like two very friendly Thai lady and one lady was actually from Singapore so they were very nice and then they were like talking to us and they actually offered to treat us dinner so we later not meet them yeah so back to that okay we are done resting and right now we are going to the Italian restaurant with the Thai aunties and we're just waiting for them um, to come and fetch us and yes this is my OOTD men 
to go to Italian restaurant. <laughs> yeah. So there's our second last day in Joaquin and right now it's currently nine and we are just going to go down nearby like Market Village. Take a look and probably find a breakfast spot nearby and just probably call it a day while well, hanging out around the area to explore and yeah see you guys later at the breakfast place okay we have reached the mall we decided to walk a little bit more to another new mall called Blue Pot initially we thought it was quite near but halfway through we were like why is it getting further and further so it's about like 15 to 20 minutes walk. It's okay, it's not a tough like walk to the place. It's just that it's very hot. So if you are not uh, like, you're not a person that prefer humid and hot weather, then we suggest you take a grab <laughs> or motorcycle. Yeah. So right now we're actually at the usual Starbucks and it's so cute like I wrote my name in Thai yes. got no idea what is this so it's very cute and now we're just going to chill here for a while <laughs> yeah. and probably shot around go back to our hotel and rest that's about it. Hello! We are at the beach behind our hotel and look at this! <gasps> the sun is setting soon and it's so pretty here. And it's actually low tide so it's really walkable. It's so nice! Happy my final second last day of at Fahin! <laughs>